Hello guys, welcome to Shop and Take Review and this is the Asus Zenfone 2 laser and this is the cool pen Note 3 so I am going to compare these two, two mobiles today so first of all let's talk about the build quality of these two devices so this device has a carved back so it is easy to feel in, in your hand but while this one is uh, very slippery and it is kind of a metal and it can easily slip from your hand so that's one more thing and you can check out our full review we have posted full review of both the devices you can check out our channel for full reviews so now i'm going to compare these two mobiles so first of all let's talk about the display quality both the devices is a 5.5 inch display and, and i got a 720p display but still i feel that uh, full pen note 3 is uh, much better in terms of display quality you can clearly notice that it's quite yellowish and this display is quite bluish and looking very fine uh, you can easily notice that and I feel that the cool pen note 3 display is much better so this is the first point now uh, now I have tested the multi touch and this uh, this Asus Gen 4 laser scored uh, uh, 10 multi touch uh, you can see that it scored 10 and and here uh, this device cool pen note 3 scored about 5 multi touch so it's in terms of multi touch testing the Asus Zenfone 2 laser goes ahead and now uh, let's talk about the call quality of these two devices so in terms of call quality I would like to say uh, Asus Zenfone 2 is slightly better uh, slightly better because uh, because it has uh, I can uh, rate it 8.5 for cool pen note 3 while this uh, Asus Zenfone 2 laser can get a vote of 9.0 and in terms of call quality both the devices is good but uh, Asus Zenfone 2 laser is quite uh, brilliant I would like to say and now <coughs> if I talk about the Android version both the device is on the lollipop but but uh, this device cool pen note 3 is running on 5, Android 5.1 while this one Asus Zenfone 2 laser is running on Android 5.0.2 so that's one more thing and now let's talk about the processor so both the device uh, is different in times of processor but uh, uh, both the device this cool pen note 3 has got a 1.3 GHz snapdragon uh, sorry not snapdragon this one is a mediatek processor and it's a octa core processor while this one cool uh, asus zenfone 2 laser has got a 1.2 GHz snapdragon 401 processor so both the device performs well in terms in terms of uh, uh, gaming and other stuffs but uh, uh, in terms of benchmark cool pen note 3 scored about 35000 while this one Asus Zenfone 2 laser scored about 23,000 only. So in terms of performance I would like to say Full Note 3 is good, good and it is better because uh, it has got a 3GB of RAM and it's an octa core processor. So, so the processor is better and the RAM is also better here and in this Full Note 3 so you can uh, expect a better performance in this Full Note 3. And in terms of gaming and other stuffs you will not face any problems in Full Note 3 while this one Asus Zenfone 2 laser does not uh, able to play big games like Nova 3 and high graphics games uh, here. So you will find uh, no problem in terms of performance in this school pen Note 3 but you, have, you can have to face some problems in Asus Zenfone 2 laser. Now come to the battery. So both the device is actually very same in terms of battery uh, not the battery performance because both the device has got a 3000 mAh battery but uh, this one uh, uh, this this is full pen note 3 this has uh, got uh, give me give me average of 4 4 to 4.5 4 hour of on stream time and while this one asus zenfone 2 laser is quite excellent i would like to say in terms of battery performance you can notice that uh, that uh, this device is um, got a screen time of 7 hours and if you uh, if you play heavy games and if you are a very very heavy user then you have to charge uh, this Asus Zenfone 2 laser once a day but if you are a moderate user then even this device Asus Zenfone 2 laser will stay stay you for two days even while uh, in this full pen note 3 we will find that uh, in terms of in, in while in gaming and high graphics performance you, you will find that this device does not give you more than four to five hour of on screen time but this device if in a moderate usage it will easily stay you for one day so in terms of battery performance I would definitely say that Asus Zenfone 2 laser goes ahead. So now let's talk about the UI. So <coughs> both the device running on a custom UI but this one is running on a cool pad and uh, cool pad UI but while this one is running on a gen UI 
and I feel that in terms of stability, Gen UI is much better than this full pen 03. But but uh, you will find some extra features here in in cool pen 03. Here is the C button. You can let me show you. This is the C button. So here is the C button, and you can do lot of stuffs from this one. You can um, you can add you can do multitask while uh, you can run two uh, two device two uh, two apps at the same time. You can you can control everything from here, and there is the there is the battery saving mode. There is the multitasking mode. There is the long standby mode, and many other things is available here in in the school pen note three. There is lot of themes, uh, not lot of themes, but there is themes, and there is much customization on this on this school pen note three. Why? Because uh, the, uh, you will find that here there is there is option of video floating mode. And there is a lot of options in, in this UI, but in Asus Gen UI you will also find some themes and stuff like that. But uh, but but in terms of is, is UI stability, I would like to say Asus Gen 2 Laser is better. But in terms of many features and personalization, Coolpen uh, Note 3 is good, good, I would like to say. And there is many extra features that are not available in Asus Gen 2 Laser. So now comes to the camera. So in terms of camera, I would like to say both the devices. Uh, not the best I would like to say so first of all uh, let me show you this picture sorry this this one this was a picture that was taken in flashlight and here is the picture also so that, this is the picture that was taken in flashlight both the pictures was taken in flashlight and this one came out to be very yellowish and the color reproduction is not that perfect here but in terms uh, it is not also perfect cool pen note 3 camera is not also perfect but uh, you can find that this uh, this uh, this photo is looking better while this one is really yellowish and and uh, the color reproduction is uh, good in this cool pen note 3 camera while the detailing is much better on this gen phone 2 and you can easily notice that and but in terms of low light condition i like to say this one uh, cool asus gen phone 2 laser does a better job this both the pictures was uh, taken in low light condition without flash but and this picture came out to be quite natural and quite original in Asus Gen 4 2 laser while this one is uh, missing lot of lack of details and the pictures came out to be not so in great. terms of front camera I would like to say this uh, this cool pair this was a picture that was taken by the front camera of full pair note and this is the Asus Gen 4 2 laser so in terms of front camera as you can easily see that this uh, this uh, this picture is really yellowish and it's not original color it's very very yellowish while this one is uh, quite natural and it's looking good here in this photo you can easily clearly notice that this one is looking good and even in, in terms of detailing cool pen note 3 goes ahead so i like to say that uh, front camera quality is better on this cool pen note 3 but um, but the so overall in my opinion i can say that the camera quality on uh, asus Gen 1 2 is better in terms of uh, in in indoor light in outdoor indoor condition sorry Indoor condition and in terms of outdoor condition both the device perform well but in terms of front camera cool pen note 3 goes ahead so now talk uh, let's talk about the sound quality of these two devices so in terms of sound quality i would like to say that this uh, asus gen 2 laser is very lack of sound and while this cool pen note 3 is uh, is is louder than this one and then uh, this asus gen 2 laser so the sound quality is actually good on this cool pen note 3 so sorry guys so this is one more thing and and third thing is that sorry one more thing is that uh, the there is the extra features uh, is like that there is a fingerprint sensor here and it's work very fine it's works very flawlessly when this one has no extra features like that it has a laser so that's why the focusing is quite good here in asus gen 1 2 laser but uh, but in terms of uh, uh, but if you see that there is the extra features of front uh, fingerprint sensor so that's a very uh, a very good plus point i would like to say in cool pad note 3 so so if you and one more thing that this uh, cool pad note 3 is priced 9000 while this asus gen 2 laser is 10000 so so if you like to choose me one device i would i would personally choose this cool pad note 3 because uh, because it's a better device for me but i, I would like to say if you are a sort of a new uh, sort of new to android and if you 
have not used any android device before so then you can uh, uh, then you can go for uh, i would suggest you to go for this asus zenfone 2 laser because it's a much stable phone and it's a uh, it's a good phone i would like to say in overall uh, overall opinion but if you uh, if you uh, if you cut down some minor bugs and minor things here in coolpen note 3 then coolpen note 3 is also a better device so it's your preferred uh, personal choice that what device you should buy or not you can also check out our full reviews that uh, that's are also available in our channel so i hope that helps so thanks for watching this video if you found this video helpful please give it a big thumbs up and thanks for watching this video again hope to see you in my next video